All right, this is Dawood Isaias, senior producer at Ashanti TV, and this is our website, AshantiTV.com, where we have our um, stream, our playout stream uh, connected. Uh, you can also find us on Roku, but uh, using Facebook, you can actually log in here. Click the Facebook login button. And once you get in, if you click the watch button here, the stream actually comes here. You click the play button, and there you go. But that's not the subject of today's tutorial. Today, what I want to do is uh, show you some really neat add-on features uh, using graphics in Uniplay. Um, something that I think you're really going to enjoy. So let's get started. Okay, what I want to show you how to do today is to add some really nice scrolling graphics um, that will really add some finishing touches to your output. So basically we're going to come over here to the menu bar, click graphics, and the first thing we want to do is create a graphics master page. So as you can see I have a couple created here. I'm just going to delete those so we can start over. So let me just remove these. And I'm going to title this Uniplay Users are awesome and that's a tribute to all the viewers that are tuning in to watch this tutorial as well as those who are Uniplay users so we're going to save that and then we're going to exit here and then we're going to come over to graphics we're going to go into the editing mode so we're going to click graphics editor and we're going to select the page to assign the scrolling text that I'm going to put here uh, to an output layer. So we're going to go ahead and uh, select Uniplay Users Are Awesome. And then we're going to add, we can add um, graphics, but in this case we're going to add uh, text. So let's click the Insert Text. And I'm going to go ahead and say Uniplay users are awesome. Exclamation, exclamation. As a matter of fact, you guys deserve one more exclamation. Um, another nice thing about our CG uh, component is that we can use um, different fonts when we create text. Uh, scrolls and graphics in Uniplay so we don't have to uh, only we're not just res restricted to using one font so what I can do here is I can take and highlight users come over here click the font setting and I'm actually going to play around with a couple of these things as you can see we can uh, we can manipulate this font in a number of ways. One of the things that I know we're going to have to do is change the position and we're going to do some play around with the color a little bit. So let's go ahead and make this impact. And we're going to click apply and then OK. And as you can see, it adjusted the um, the font of the user's text, which is uh, what we told it to do. And um, let's go ahead and preview this. And as you can see, we can't actually see where on the page it's appearing. So now we need to adjust this, and I think we need to take it to about 200. 
and let's preview it now and as you can see there it is right there now the other thing that I think I'm going to want to do here is I want to increase the font size so let's come over here well first um, we need to make sure that we highlight our text because I want uh, not only do I want all the font to be the same size, but I want to make sure that something, that the font setting applies to something. So we highlight that, and we're going to make it 48. And let's preview it now. Okay, so that looks a lot better. Um, I think it's a little bit low, so we're going to in, we're going to decrease this value some more. Let's go down to about 190. Preview it now. Okay, so that looks good. Um, the other thing I want to do is I want to take uh, Uniplay, highlight that, and we're going to change that font color. And let's make it uh, something like that just for the sake of demonstration. And let's preview it now. All right, so that looks good. Now, we could also come down here and change the speed. Let's preview that. You can see it's moving a little faster. And let's see here. And that's uh, that looks okay. We could also change the direction. We can, instead of going right to left, we could go left to right. But uh, that's not for a good read. I could, that would probably be useful when reading a, uh, a font like Arabic. So uh, for our purposes, let's take it back to 1. And I think I'm going to decrease the size of this font just a little bit. So instead of 48, we're going to make it 45. Let's preview that. Forgot to change my... Uh, direction setting so here we go again we wanted to scroll to the left and then the last thing I want to do is I want to make that alpha bring it down a little bit so let's go back and let's take it up to about 85 I think all right 86 so we're going to preview that again. All right, that's fine. So now all we need to do is save this. And um, we're going to exit from here. Remember in Uniplay, we always save before exiting. And then um, we need to go to our settings menu, come down to our overlay setting, our graphics overlay setting. And we want to make sure that um, show graphics on filler is selected. And if we have a playlist running like we do in this case, we want to show the graphics when the playlist is uh, also running. So let's go ahead and save that. All right. And if we come over here to our Playout engine, we'll see there that our scroll is appearing over the top of our text. Isn't that neat? Okay, so I think I want to tweak it a little bit more, so I want to come back over here to my graphics, go back to my editor, and I'm going to go back to the page that I need, and I'm going to edit this and I'm gonna make this a little bit more visible than it's the way it's showing let's put it about 120 all right 119 yeah that looks a little better so let's save that exit over here and let's come back to our play out and let's Turn this off, turn it back on. And as you can see, we have a better looking graphics output there. All right, so that does it for today. Um, 
again um, you know one of the nice things about uh, Uniplay is that there are a bunch of hidden little things that you can do uh, so feel free to play around with things and um, we're sure that you're going to uh, find some of those secrets and use them to the best of uh, your abilities. So again, thank you for joining us for today's tutorial and we hope you continue to enjoy your Uniplay experience. Take care.